If you want to keep a track record of all your Dropbox files into MS Excel, then this video is for you because here I'm going to teach you how to add Dropbox file links to MS Excel automatically. So what will happen every time a new file is uploaded in your Dropbox folder, the same file link will be added automatically into your MS Excel spreadsheet and not just into the Excel. If you want to organize your Dropbox file into Google Sheets, into Airtable, that is also possible. So if you also want to learn how you can set this automation for yourself come with me and i will show you the whole process step by step so this is my dropbox account and this is the ms excel file which i have created and as soon as i will upload any new file here you will see how the file link will be added automatically into ms excel but in order to do that i'll have to first integrate dropbox and ms excel and i'm going to do that with pabli connect it is an amazing integration and automation software via which you can easily connect multiple applications and automate your task and you can also reach here by typing pabli.com slash connect i will also attach this link into my description box for your reference now if you are a new user of Pabli connect you will have to sign up for free where you will also get free tasks every month in order to test such kinds of amazing automation i'm already an existing user so firstly i have clicked on sign in then i have selected this Pabli connect access now among all the application and this is how i have reached to the dashboard of Pabli connect now click on this view button that is create workflow and provide any random name to your workflow to your automation okay so i I have pasted the name as when new file is uploaded in Dropbox, add a file link in MS Excel. Okay. After providing the name, click on this create option and then you will find two boxes in front of you. So these are actually trigger and action. So here trigger means when this happens, action means do this. So whenever this happens, automatically do this. Understand with an example also, whenever a sale happen in a payment gateway application, then automatically send an email via Gmail application application according to our use case whenever any new file is uploaded into the dropbox application then automatically save that file link into the ms excel application okay so this is how you need to always select the application in which you are building an automation okay in this case i'm building an automation in dropbox and microsoft excel application so that is why i have selected i have searched these two application okay now i'm going to connect this dropbox with pabli connect and i want that uh, the automation should triggers when a new file is added to a specific folder so that is why i am selecting this particular trigger event now i'm going to connect a dropbox with the pabli connect so click on this add a new connection then click on connect with dropbox and since i'm already logged in into my dropbox account so the authorization is successful directly it has not asked me any access okay now it is asking me to provide the folder path so you will have to read the instructions that while checking a file in the folder name sample folder the folder path will be like this okay so i have the folder name as this all blog files submitted via freelancer okay so assume that some freelancer is actually uploading the file into this specific uh, uh, folder okay i am uploading the file of the freelancers here okay and i want that i want that those file links should be also added should be also organized automatically into ms excel that is why i am creating this uh, automation okay this is just an example okay so i have copied the name of my folder and as per the instruction i am providing the very same name here okay here you can see and further read the instructions that further in sub folder the sample folder and the new folder the folder path will look like this okay so here the main folder name will appear and the subfolder name will appear okay so this is how you will have to provide the path of your subfolder okay so i have provided the path name uh, folder path basically i will be clicking on this button save and send test request and you will see how the details of this particular folder will be captured via pabli connect but before that i am going to upload a file in front of you into this particular folder all right so i have one pdf file of my blog okay which i am going to upload here and once the uploading is finished i will then click on that button and you will see how the details of that particular folder that particular file will be captured via pabli connect all right here you can see the response is received let me show you the details one by one all right so here i have the shareable link okay so let me check that wh what particular link is this all about all right it is the same 
same link all right now here i have the uh, response to url also the the visibility of this particular file is actually public all right and here i have the path also which i have mentioned into uh, which i have mentioned above here you can see all right and let me show you other details as well one by one so here we have the type of the file here we have the name of the file as well okay so this is how i have all the details of the dropbox and the first step of our automation is actually done okay the presence of this data clearly shows that connection in between dropbox and public connect is working absolutely fine now what will happen every time a new file is uploaded into this specific folder public connect will capture that file in every 10 minutes automatically okay this trigger will check for the new data in every 10 minutes okay so just in case if you're not if your file is not getting captured in real time when this automation is working don't worry about that you will have to wait patiently for at least 10 minutes okay now the first step is done finally i will be adding this i will be connecting this microsoft excel to pably connect okay and in the action event i will be adding this add row to worksheet now click on connect click on add a new connection click on connect with microsoft excel and now here you will have to provide the access of your excel account in which you want to save the files all right so i have provided the access and here you can see the authorization is successful and you will see how microsoft excel will be connected with pably connect and it is connected and the very first thing it is asking me to select a workbook okay so here you can see whatever the workbooks are available inside my excel account have started visible here since we are connected okay so let me show you uh, uh, i have the file link i have the workbook name as all file links okay so i am going to search for the very same workbook that is all file link all right here we have that very same workbook asking to select the worksheets so i just have a single sheet only with the name data so you will see how it will be selected automatically now as soon as i have selected this worksheet and workbook whatever the columns i have available inside my excel account inside my excel spreadsheet have started visible here here you can see well why it is visible uh, like this i'll have to save i'll have to refresh this automation once all right so i have refreshed this workflow let me check whether that data has gone or not all right well it is still visible i'll have to check with my team that what is going uh, what is wrong with this okay but don't worry about that you can ignore it for now i will get it fixed so currently i just have a single column into my spreadsheet so that is why a single column field is visible here but i would also like to capture the file name so i will be adding i am actually adding this file name column also inside my spreadsheet inside my excel sheet and then i will click on this refresh to fetch new items and you will see how one more column will visible here as soon as i will refresh this particular section and here you can see the second column is also started visible here and that error is also gone okay so now i just need to provide the file link and the file name here and this is how the data will be saved automatically and don't worry i don't need to manually copy the data from anywhere and paste it here manually okay remember we have just received the response into our previous step okay so i am going to map this particular data into these fields okay into these two fields and mapping is very simple inside public connect you just need to click on this particular field and you will find the above data here in the drop down okay simply file uh, simply find the link of your file okay so here i have the file link all right so let me map the shareable link and secondly i will be adding the file name all right so where is the file name i'll have to check all right here i have the file name as blog on digital marketing along with this extension okay now i will be clicking on this button say and send test request and you will see how the data will be added automatically i'll have to first wait for the response all right the response is received already and here you can see the file link is added and the file name is also added okay so this is how now onwards every time you are going to upload any new file here into your dropbox the same file link along with the file name will be added automatically for sure into this 
excel sheet okay and uh, don't worry if your files are not getting captured in real time you will have to wait for at least 10 minutes because our trigger here is uh, uh, this trigger will check for the new data in every 10 minutes it is a polling based trigger so that is why it might take some time it might take at least 10 minutes okay and to automate this process you need to create this automation inside Pabli connect just once after that you can simply close Pabli connect sit back and relax because Pabli connect will take care of all the tasks in the back end you do not have to do anything manually after setting up this automation okay and just in case if you want to access this workflow this automation inside your Pabli connect account I will also attach the shareable link of my workflow into the description box you just need to click on that link and sign up into the Pabli connect and you will be able to access the very same workflow the very same automation inside your Pabli connect account that to for free and here I have forgot to tell you a very very important thing that is whatever the details we have mapped into this particular field this data will replace automatically when this automation will work in real time this is how this automation is going to take place okay just in case if you will provide any data manually this data will remain same but whatever the data details you have mapped here these details will be replaced automatically when a new file will be uploaded here okay so what will happen a new file will arrive here public connect will capture that detail and it will automatically replace these values with that new file link okay so this is how this automation is going to take place not just these applications you can integrate multiple applications and automate your business with Pabli connect you can ask your queries at forum.pabli.com my team will surely answer to your questions this is the website of Pabli connect and for the latest updates of Pabli connect and unique automation ideas you can join our facebook group that is formget.deals if you have found this video helpful in any way share it with your friends and colleagues and also help them to automate their business like share and subscribe thank you for watching this video